Hello mods, it is Crashmaster. Now before we get into the big point of making this video, I just wanted to say a quick um, couple of minor channel updates real quick. So, first off, um, I, I have a Twitter and Instagram. I'm just going to quickly plug them in. If you don't want to follow them, that's okay. But um, Instagram, for me, it's mostly just to give small announcements and do maybe like this story thing. I'm trying to figure it out because I'm kind of, I'm, I'm not really like, I don't, I'm not that active on it. Um, but um, I'm going to try to use my Twitter and Instagram, especially my Twitter, to do like little behind the scenes things here and there. Little teasers um, and um, things like that. And um, especially with like my old CM12 news segment. Since that does take a lot of uh, effort to edit. And honestly I'm not sure how I'm going to really put it uh, into the channel with my like my schedule. And I'm because I'm usually busy and I'm trying to get other videos and new stuff coming up as well. On Twitter there's uh, what I've been trying to do kind of for a while. Is put like a little bit of a list for the month of January, February, March and stuff like that. So if you guys want any major updates on news, consoles, um, um, for games, um, stuff like that. It's going to be there on Twitter and a couple of other things here and there. And uh, I also do actually have a theory. Uh, I'm actually posting a couple of theories because I don't want to step on um, Theory Channel's toes. There's already a lot of them from Darko to um, um, uh, that, this other channel I forgot. Um, I'll probably put it on, this, on the screen maybe, depending how I edit this video. Because this video, I'm recording this on the day it's supposed to be uploaded. And also Darko... Um, obviously you have the Game Theorist film, now Food Theory, amazing by the way, I really like those food ones. But um, just letting you all know, I do have a, a small theory right there on the channel SMG4 on one of their latest videos. So, um, and I, if you are a fan of their animation, I really recommend that you uh, check them out. Now. Um, Instagram, that's mostly just going to be like a little behind the scenes and stuff like that. I really do have a couple of things there kind of some of that's already kind of been like some of it's been left behind some of it is still gonna put um put out the major plot point and um what the uh, and what i mean for spoilers is that like certain videos but mostly the mind crash series now that is a very very important series on the channel it's one of the i say in terms of views it is probably higher up there some are fall flat some are pretty decent but that is the main focus of the channel it's the one i started with it's the one i'm gonna keep for possibly the whole channel maybe depending how long that's gone because i've been doing this for over four years now oh boy man i feel old just saying that Oh man, I started this channel when I was in middle school, and I'm 17 right now. I'm 17. I think I started that channel when I was, uh, what, like, uh, 13-ish, I think? And now it's 12, 13-ish? Man, I've come a long way. But, um, anyway, <laughs> besides that, um, Twitter and Instagram, you don't need to follow it. You can check it every now and then, but please, I really would appreciate it, especially Twitter, because that's what I'm really going to use, because I prefer that platform a little bit of writing it out. Although, unfortunately, I had to learn the hard way while writing my theory. You can only write so much in so many words and so many letters, so it is going to be kind of small and spread out. But uh, just bear with me, please. Now, um, for the Minecraft series, I really, really do recommend you check that out if you're a big fan of the channel. I really do um, recommend it because it's a Minecraft. You know, it's Minecraft. Most sold, one of the most sold games, most sold game out there, owned by Microsoft, stuff like that, blah, 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 I'm not going to get into that, but I really do recommend that you watch episode 54, at least, at least t till the end, and 59, because 59 did take, uh, it, honestly, it did underperform, I wanted it to get a few more views, no offense, it just, I'm not calling anybody out or anything. It's all me. It's all the channel. I know I'm not a big channel. I'm not. Just, I only have like 200 subscribers. I'm not saying like a million views. I just recommend if you guys like the Minecraft stuff I put out. I think you're really gonna like episode 54 and especially episode 59 because that did take a lot of work to edit and um, create. Um, 59 does have Steel Shot and I, I believe 54 does also have Steel Shot in it. Um, if I'm right. So I really recommend you're going to want to watch those because trust me, it is. Also, uh, just letting you all know, the reason why it says season one is because now the series is going to be split between the seasons. I'm thinking about like the, I'm almost at 60 episodes in the Minecraft series. And honestly, I'm debating on whether or not like 
season one should be the first 100 episodes. Honestly, I'm not sure because I, then I'm like, should season two be 100 or stuff like that? But that seems a little too far fetched. And even now, right now, I'm debating if I should split season one, like all nearly 60 episodes so far, 59. 59 episodes into season one and two because there are like kind of you could kind of i could kind of split it into season one and then season two where it gets more into like the story i'm trying to tell because there is a story in the series it is just like a bit of a mystery and there's little clues here and there you really have to kind of write them down and kind of li listen out for them because it is a story i'm trying to tell but trust me, it will be worth it, and I hope it's something that a lot of you who like projects such as uh, Five Nights at Freddy's with lore and Benny Nigma scene for its more story-driven, where there's a lot more story elements, especially with it. It's not really a horror story, don't get me wrong, I just like those franchises, and they're the best examples. But trust me, I think this is a project a lot of people, like maybe some of you, would like. So trust me, keep an eye for my Twitter, especially, and my Instagram. There's going to be a lot of things right there. Also, um, a couple other things. Forza Horizon 4 will be back on the channel because I did re um, I did recently up upload a video of that a while ago. Rocket League is coming back because they officially have started Season 2, which I just played uh, yesterday, not yesterday, um, a couple days ago with Still Shot for the first time in a while. And honestly, it is terrific. It's really, really cool. Can't wait to get back on there. Cuphead might come back soon i'm trying to do i'm trying to find people to play with me just to make make it a lot more fun and creative because while i love the game playing it by myself um obviously the new dlc is going to make it even three players i'm pretty sure with miss challenge i'm not sure if there's going to be three players or you could just choose two of the three I might need to look back on that. Texture Pack Tours will be coming back. That's a series that is probably one of the best on the channel. It's got the most views. You guys seem to love it. It helps you all a lot, or at least a few of you from the comments. So don't worry. That will be coming back up on the new version of Minecraft because I pretty much did everything on the Minecraft Xbox One Edition, PS4 Edition um wii u edition the nintendo switch edition is it's it's discontinued pretty much and I, I think it's only like the mario maybe another thing but i'm pretty sure i i'm pretty sure i did all the mashups and texture packs from all of the main versions and now that's all left is the bedrock edition which is the the new version of minecraft the official better together version that's it's like uh, still a bunch of names I, i'm not sure what to call it i call it the official version because now it's really the mainline version besides java and uh, education and a few other things here and there because a lot of stuff's been continue discontinued like the legacy consoles which is like all most of the additions of minecraft but that's all the announcements i have for now just a couple things here and there and now on to the purpose of this video so, why do I, I don't know, I, I don't know, what because I'm not even sure what I'm going to title this video, I kind of want to title this video, Why I Hate Valentine's Day, like, <laughs> honestly, it's like, it's like, you know, it's like, people, you know how some people say, it's like, hate's a strong word, hate's a strong word, but honestly, I just really, really do not like the holiday, I just don't, I really don't. <sighs> and why? Because, well, <laughs> it just upsets me. It really, really just does. And honestly, it's it's just been it's just been really, really hard, especially in quarantine. Now, obviously, some of you out there who probably have been staying with some of your family or with certain people, we all know that when you stay with certain people, even though you do like them, like your family or certain friends, at some point there's going to be a little bit of tensions. So you're going to go crazy and stuff like that. And I kind of am in there as well because uh, I haven't been able to see my friends in person too much. Like, I've only, I've only really ever seen my friend um, Steel Shot. Um, who I'm not going to say his real name, I'm just going to say Steel Shot, um, basically for that, and besides him, I've only seen him really, like, over each other's houses compared to all my other friends, who I've only really seen either with face cam, like, um, you know, like Discord, Snapchat, stuff like that, and it's just been really hard. I'm pretty sure a lot of you, like, um, really can relate to this with quarantine still going on, and there's a lot of, like, tests 
um, going on about, like, new vaccines and new stages of it climbing up and stuff like that. But I'm not really here to talk about that per se. What I'm here to talk about is why I do not like Valentine's Day. <laughs> oh my god. So, I'm really, I'm just letting you all know, like, I have to, I have to, it's just been kind of difficult. Like, physically and mentally, I'm trying to get my health better. My mental health has been all over the place for the past few years, and I am seeing a therapist. This is like one of those types of videos, guys. It's like a story time thing. So, uh, just prepare yourself. But, and I am I am actually on medication, although I don't think it does anything, but people say otherwise, so whatever. But <laughs> main, main point of this uh, I'm trying to get across is that quarantine hasn't, personally, it hasn't affected me all that much. I much prefer doing school in... In uh, in I I prefer doing school inside than outside. And it's like, oh, the, he's a teenager, you know the hormones. They don't like people. Yada 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 yada. I already hear all those people saying stuff like that, but that's not the case. It's just that I just don't. I uh, it's it's kind of that, but it's more or less the fact that people, the the majority of people in I just don't get along with people that that much. Like it's really really hard for me to find a group of people or even just a person in a particular area that I can really like talk to and even then it's like I really don't ha I have a hard time making long lasting connections because there were a few people that I talked to in high school because the majority of like the people I know still to this day that I call my friends my closest friends I've met them in middle school and not really in high school and it's weird because like there was other things other places that I have met them too that I'm not going to talk about for personal reasons, but it, 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 I haven't really done anything in high school, honestly, high school's just, but it really, it's just been, it's just not me, it's not me, I, I've been, like, and personally, I've been begging my parents to let me do homeschooling or something like that, but they just weren't having it, so it's like, okay, I just suffered through it, and now I'm in 12th grade, and in my senior year, and now I'm almost in college, and and uh, it's just been really tough because the fact is I have to balance out my family life. I have to balance out like my family, my friends, my um, <laughs> my schoolwork, and YouTube, and my and other other things as well that I that that I have to balance out as well. So it has been. That's why I haven't been doing too many videos really in 2020, especially because it it has been very very rough. Like, man, I it would, it's really, I would have to go back, you know what, I might, I might go back on my channel, not right now and put it on the screen, probably not. I might go back and check what year I did the most amount of uploads. I might go check that, because I'm actually very curious to see what year I, what, when did my video numbers decline down? Not by views, but how many uploads did I do? Was it the start? Was it the middle? Was it, like, right now slash the end, like, the present day? Not saying the channel's ending. I'm just saying, like, at the end of what were the presents so far. Like, I'm, I'm kind of curious on what year was the lowest of what year was the highest. Was it the early, was the early days with the, the, um, the, the present? Was it somewhere in the middle? I'm not sure. I'm actually kind of curious. I might go look into that in my channel settings and analytics, stuff like that. But anyway, it's just been uh, it's just been very difficult because nowadays I've been feeling very tired, just tired of everything. I've been very sluggish. I haven't been feeling too motivated to get out of bed per se. It's just been very, very difficult. And Honestly, it's just not, it's just, it's just been so hard, like, just pushing through it. It has been, I'm not gonna lie. And I've, I've just always just been fighting this stuff for, like, as long as I can, like, not remember, not, not that far, but, like, for quite a few years. Over half a decade I've been doing, fighting this kind of stuff, and, honestly, it's just been so difficult and now that this holiday and now it's been almost a year of quarantine and there's been so much news about like the vaccine good or bad whatever point is is just that it's just not getting any better i'm not gonna say any of my opinions out there 
because I, that would be causing a lot of controversy and everything like that, and it's something I don't want on my channel because I'm trying to grow it, not burn it to the ground when I'm just starting to c climb up there. But point is, is that Valentine's Day has kind of let me make this clear. This is the day I'm, re I'm recording this and uploading this the day after Valentine's Day, which is a Monday, because that's usually when I upload. I usually upload my videos around, like, 8 to 10 p.m., depending. That's, like, the average 8 to 10 p.m. Um, New York, Florida time, like, up there to down there, like, that side. I, I forgot. Is it, like, Eastern Standard Time? I think that's what it is. That's usually what I when I upload. But, um, so I kind of have to do this fast, somewhat. Because this is the only video going out today, and I'm very, very sorry about that as well. Because I did think about playing a couple of, like, Valentine's, maybe dating sim kind of games. Like, certain things, like, um, like, uh, they had that, you know, that game Doki Doki Literature Club. And, like, um, but that's kind of like a horror thing. And I was like, do I really want to go into that? Even though I, I do like the game, and I do like the design of the characters, and the, the lore is pretty fascinating. Uh, and like the mysteries and there's even games like honey pop which i was like i see videos of it and <laughs> i was like what the heck no 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 i'm not i can't do that on the channel because my channel is not meant for kids but it's definitely not in that territory it's definitely not there no no and i can't censor it out and stuff like that obviously but i'm like Look, I, I went into, I literally looked up, like, the day of YouTube, like, uh, different types of violations of, like, nudity and other things, like, and copyright, stuff like that. Because some of the content on channels that if you are playing certain games, like, possibly, like, Mario, for example, some of that stuff will say copyright content, stuff like that. And... Honestly, I'm not really getting to that as well because that's other stuff I'm still learning about and it's been on the channel for years, but it's not like I make money off the videos or anything like that and that's I never intended this channel to be making money and I'm never ever really going to do that unless maybe I can. But I'm not ready for that because I already have I have a passion in science where I want to do other stuff and uh, this is my last year in high school, so I have to really prepare for this stuff. I literally submitted my application a few days ago and my mom's been driving me crazy over it i'm not gonna lie she's been really driving me crazy about it but uh, what does this all have to do with valentine's day well it kind of pushed me over the edge valentine's day the day yesterday when i woke up here let me give you a little backstory yesterday morning when i woke up i did not feel good like, there was just a, there was like a box of like candies and chocolates and stuff like that up there. I woke up like so late because honestly my, my sleep schedule has just been out of whack. I don't have a sleep schedule. Fun fact, I don't like sleeping. I hate sleeping. I wish I could stay up forever because you know how much work I can get done. So much work, but nope. My human body needs to sleep. It needs to rest. So, nope. That's not going to happen. I also will be, I also did get these macaroons i very much love these these are amazing i especially love the, the pistachio ones i love those actually i love macaroons and i, I yeah, and then i had like a bunch of other stuff but besides that honestly at this point valentine's day for me it's the only good part about it. the only good part is the candy that's it everything else i hate the mushy mushy stuff i hate all that stuff because don't get me wrong like it's valentine's day it's not one of those like um, I don't know. I don't even know if it's an official holiday per se, like Martin Luther King Jr. Day or Thanksgiving or even Christmas. I don't. I don't think it stacks up to those levels. I think it's just like I heard people say it's more of a commercial holiday, stuff like that. You know, like restaurant reservations and like deals for like the stuff like baskets and and um chocolates and all that other stuff. But <laughs> honestly, I. I, I, I would, this video was gonna, and honestly, this video was gonna be about me going through my love life and my experience with women, because I am straight, I am a straight male, um, if you can't tell, if you can't tell, then yes, I am, but, um, 
I feel like that was just gonna go kind of off the I feel like that was just gonna be more of a random video in a sense and I didn't want to say too much because like there wasn't anything like too fascinating there was just one or two things here or there where like I I wrote a poem and I even bought a ring for this one girl I'm not and yes this did happen <laughs> and if you're if you're watching this and you know who you are I am so 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 Sorry, I'm so sorry, but point being, and no, she did not re reciprocate my feelings to her. Honestly, it's just been like really, really bad because my, me have I never ever been in a relationship, like a full ongoing, full steady relationship, and I don't think I'm ever going to be in one. If I'm being honest, do I not want to be in one? That's not what I'm saying. No. Could I be in one? I don't know. Because with all the emotional baggage and trauma and experience in my life and what I'm planning to do for my future, YouTube and other things, I don't know if that's really something I can do in a relationship. Like, friends-wise, that's one thing, in a sense. And even then, that's still something something I'm still sort of debating about. Because some of my friends do um, partake in the stuff I'm interested in. Obviously, you're going to have certain common interests and stuff like that. But it's one of those things where it's like... If I'm... if Not saying I'm insane. I'm not saying that. But it's like, if you're not mentally stable or physically he healthy like or mentally healthy... Should you really be in a relationship? Because that's going to add to more stuff if they care about you and they're worrying about you and they're going to try to help you and they put stuff aside. And I don't know. Because I've had my fair share of crushes and love interests here and there. Some who are my friends still. But it just, it just doesn't work out. And does it suck? <laughs> yeah. It does suck. But you have to move on with it. Because life keeps going. And it's not going to stop. Time has always been one of my favorite subjects. In science especially to talk about. And honestly it's just one of those things where it's like. Sometimes time just feels like it's my enemy. Cause, and we all feel like that right? You want to drive? Guess what? You're too young and you can't drive. You want to you wanna get a job and um, skip past the half of school and everything like that? Too bad you have to go through each year slowly and slowly. You want to wait for you want you can't wait till quarantine? You want it to go faster? Too bad you have to take it every single day because just because it's 2021 and it's not 2020 20, uh, anymore 2020 anymore doesn't mean it disappeared. No, we're still stuck inside a lot of us. And <laughs> Valentine's Day just kind of, it just, I guess it was the straw that broke the camel's back. Because it just, it just really did. It just kind of reminds me of, like, I, I just, like, not doing well. Because I, I'm not the, I'm not the... This is so hard for me to say. I'm not the strongest. I'm not the most handsome. I'm not the s smartest, even. And i that's probably one of my best features, my intelligence. It's probably the only thing I have going for me, honestly. And I'm, and I'm not the most fit or um, well-managed person out there. No. I do my best. That's all all of us can do. That's all any of us should do. man and I am working on myself still like recently I've been trying to eat better trying to focus on making videos and um, I have this week off as well so I am relaxing you know trying to take a little bit of a break don't worry three videos will be back up 
by um this uh my next week i promise don't worry maybe i'll have maybe i'll try to get uh well no that's my playstation that's where i'm gonna upload three playstation videos but probably after next monday that's maybe when i'll be able to have someone in the video maybe still shot maybe some other people i'm not sure there are a lot of things i have to balance out in the channel as well because there are a lot of games coming up and there's a lot of stuff i want to play some stuff i'm trying to like transition out of in you know, of like switch constantly like there's just so many things because obviously when to be to stay relevant you have to st you have to go with the new stuff sometimes and i'm not one to like join stuff like fidget spinners and dabbing and memes and stuff like that that's not really me i just do stuff what i want to do on the channel and there are a lot of stuff i want to do on the channel but the thing is too much stuff means that it's too hard to cram it all in into like the space of like i only do three videos one week which isn't too bad but when there's so much content on the channel as it is, and so much more stuff I have planned, it's just so much of a gap until the next video of one series. Which is really, really difficult when I want to do stuff for my Terraria series, my Minecraft series, my Dragon Ball Xenoverse series. Those are the big series on the channel that I want to focus on. But, you, it, and while it is fun to work on, it does take time, and even though it might be done... Like, I have to keep track and make sure I remember all the details perfectly, and it's going to be a long jump. It could be weeks, heck, usually months, until the next video, or even a year or two, because that's what happened to Rocket League and Forza Horizon 4. I had to put those on pause to do other stuff, and I really like those series, but it's just really, really hard to balance it all out. So I guess what I'm trying to say is that, please be patient with me, and... Back to what I said at the beginning with my Twitter and Instagram, I will be doing small leaks and little teasers here and there about the series I really care about, especially the Minecraft one. Little things here and there. Um, putting up the updates about what's going on, personal life maybe, especially my channel. And I appreciate the ones who have stuck with me all these years and supported me for all these years, especially my friends and family. Thank you all. But, why do I hate Valentine's Day? Because it, re it reminds me of my struggles. It kind of just... Did it break me? No. I'm still fighting. I'm always fighting. I'm, I'll be fighting for years and decades to come. Because that's what we all do. But it doesn't mean I like it. Do I hate it? That's a bit of a strong word. Do I dislike it? I think so. I would say yes. And it comes back every single year. It reminds me that I probably won't be in a relationship anytime soon. And maybe, who knows, maybe a week from now I'll find someone out of nowhere on the street or on a dating app or something. I don't know. But to close this off, i just like to say thank you for sticking with me. And I hope you still stick with me. So, that's enough for now. <laughs> you don't need to see this anymore. Hear me rant. So, hopefully you all enjoyed the video. Please leave a like and subscribe. And don't forget to hit that notification bell. So that way you guys will be notified for next week's uploads. And I will see you all later. Later, mites.